How you doing guys? This is my 1934 truck. I didn't show it off last time to you. Didn't have time, but uh, check it out, man. This is really, really nice. Yeah, see, it's all registered with the five-year plates. It's good for uh, 2024. And uh, look how nice that bed is. See in the back here, built by Ford, powered by Chevy. This way we don't get stuck. <laughs> yeah, check out the inside here. Got nice bucket seats, tilt steering wheel, great sound system, all the gauges work, turbo 400 transmission. It's got the 350 uh, small block Chevy motor in it. Got disc brakes in the front, high rise manifold, twin four barrels, and this truck is beautiful. That's all I got to say about it. Okay guys, so anyway on my uh, video a couple of videos ago I promised you to I was going to try out the FN machine guns, the best machine guns, the finest machine guns made in the United States. And they're making them now for the military. And uh, we have them all right here. This is my daughter, Melissa, and uh, she's a certified NRA instructor. You know, if you guys want to get your concealed weapons permit, just give her a call. Hi, okay. guys. And uh, she's going to start off and tell you about a couple of these uh, FN machine guns. Hey, guys. So uh, here we have a couple of the SCAR 16S's, 17S's, and the PS90's. Um, and the 249, we also um, have an FN 509 that Mel has over there. And a uh, common uh, gun that FN likes to make also is the FN uh, pistol. We have seven pistol. Um, these two are uh, the SCAR Light 16S's. This is a CQC that stands for Close Quarter Combat. Uh, the SCAR Light typically shoots about 600, 625 rounds per minute at about 2,900 uh, feet per second. The uh, SCAR Heavy, or the 17S, uh, shoots about 600 rounds per minute and it shoots about, at about 2,300 rounds per second. Um, over here is the PS90. Um, they made the PS90 really because the government wanted a sort of a close quarter combat, uh, easy to maneuver sub machine gun, and uh, so easy to put in vehicles and uh, get around corners and close quarters and stuff like that. It shoots a 5.7 round. The 5.7 round actually is a 40 grain bullet. Uh, it shoots about 2,300 feet per second, and uh, it actually comes in six different types: the subsonic, the uh, lead-free sporting round duty and uh, tracer and they used to make a hollow point um, but I think they discontinued that so uh, really cool round they range about $30 for 50 rounds so not the cheapest round but uh, yeah they're a really cool round and they're made by Fiocchi uh, who uh, really uh, gives it to FN and also Federal who uh, manu manufactures it for um, American Eagle so we're gonna shoot some off and show you how they they function so Okay, guys, and I just want to tell you, all these uh, weapons, every one of them that you see on the table here, they do make them semi-automatic, you know, for civilian use. So uh, you could always order one of these from uh, Dragon Arms, okay. if they have it in stock. These were a little difficult to get because we needed a sheriff's letter, uh, so we were lucky to have that. Um, they do make a 20S now, which is really nice, but uh, we have them in full auto, so that's really cool. Okay, well, we're going to start off with the uh, 308. This is the SCAR 17, 308, so we cock it, take the safety off, and there's the targets over there. Okay, then we switch it, full auto. See them bowling pins fall? That's pretty super. Now I'm going to shoot the PS90, take the cap off. These are really cool because the bullets start this way and then they actually turn horizontal as it shoots. Alright, let's see if uh, it is in full auto, so we'll go ahead and just rack it back. A little heavy for me. So the trigger, you have to depress it all the way for it to be full auto. There we go. Pretty fun. Good. 
Good shooting, Melissa. Yeah. These are so much fun. Okay, I'm going to demonstrate the uh, SCAR 16. Shoots a 5.56 five, or a 223. Put it on full auto, cock it, and it's ready to go. This is a short barrel. Okay, watch some bowling pins. Man, I love starting the morning like this. I really get a bang out of it. As Mel says, these guns are beautiful. All right, so now I'm going to shoot the 17S. Or not. Okay. You already shot they that one? Yep. So this is a scar heavy. Let's see if I can handle it. Okay. Let's see. Oh, it's ready. It's ready? Okay. Yep. There we go. Has a reciprocating hand handle. Woo! -hoo! Woo! That's actually really easy to shoot. Yeah, how many people could do this in that backyard? Nobody I know. You want to do that last one? Okay, this here is the uh, this is the FN nine millimeter. It's the uh, 509. It's got a 24 round uh, magazine. And we're just going to shoot a few 9mm bullets. The bullets are 115 grain bullets. They go 1,100 feet per second. It shoots pretty fast. When I have time, I might make one of these full auto. You want me to do this last PS90? Yeah, yeah, do the other one. All right, so we're going to do the last PS90. One more time. If you're looking to get this gun, they're actually really hard to find right now. Um, Effin's not making a whole lot of them, so there we go. Let's see. So it has three different notches, so let's just play around with it. That's safety. And that's going to be semi. We found the, the fun button. It's Got a fun it. gun. They're all fun guns. <laughs> okay, like now we're going to try out the 249, like the soldiers are using right now overseas. And like I said, they do make all these weapons semi-automatic if uh, any of my customers would like to purchase one. This one shoots with an open bolt. That means the bolt has to be open first before you load it. Same as the uh, M60. Okay, guys. It's open fire. Yahoo! Man, was that fun. How was that, Melissa? Yeah, look at the targets. It blew them all up. They're all blown away. This is obviously the gun to have. Yeah. Melissa doesn't know it, but I, I put a little tannerite behind the bowling pins. <laughs> got him. Yep. Got him. Dad's always got surprises. Always. Always. <laughs> I feel bad for her, you know. She's got to find a boyfriend, you know. The guys find out Dragon Man's her father, uh, they, don't even, they don't even call her. I'm going to be single for a long time. Yeah. Well, we'll find her one. Yeah, it's got to be the right one. The right one. Yeah, I'm tired of beating up these guys. <laughs> okay, guys. So anyway, you have anything else to say, Melissa? That's about it. Thanks for having me on uh, your Facebook page. Oh, yeah. Boy, look at the mess we made. Yep. And uh, I guess Mel would say, see that? You see that? <laughs> okay, right. guys. Hey, let me show you some uh, brass we have here. Yeah, check this out. So anyway, uh, yeah, right here, this is sick... Uh, 6,000 pounds of brass, three tons, and uh, it's all one-shot brass. See, it's a little of everything. It's 9 millimeter, it's 223, it's 308, it's, it's 45, and uh, I'm going to start selling all this for uh, $3 a pound. So if you reloading guys are interested, uh, just come on out at $3 a pound. You can't beat it. Okay, Melissa, you ready to go for breakfast? All right, let's go. Yeah, we got to open up soon. 
Yeah, right now it's about 8.30 in the morning. It's already about almost 70 degrees. And uh, one more thing I want to say. I'm looking for uh, like a retired uh, history teacher to help me with the military museum. We're probably going the next week or two, we're going to be opening up the military museum. And I definitely need help this summer. And uh, we'll pay you good. So we need uh, like a retired or, a, you know, a history teacher, somebody that knows a lot about military history especially. And I'm looking for a couple of more range officers to run my shooting ranges here, especially on a weekend. We're packed on the weekends. I can't believe how many people are coming here. When I moved here almost 40 years ago, there was 200 and something thousand people in Colorado Springs. There's almost 600,000 here. You know why? Because somebody on Facebook keeps saying, it's another beautiful day. <laughs> in fact, today's going to be 80. Can't beat it. Can't beat the weather in Colorado. Right. Okay, guys, you have a great day, and thanks a lot for watching. We appreciate it. Bye, guys.